Hey guys, I am Avix Rising Sun, and this is going to be the last random game of the week for a while. Uh, it is Stronghold 3. Um, I think this is a fairly new game, I don't know. Uh, I'm not entirely sure. I just kind of saw this on Steam and thought, well, oh, it looks like a decent game, I'll go get it. <laughs> um, and yeah, the, for all those that actually don't know what a random game of the week is, it's basically where I show you what a game is like, but unlike a Let's Play, it doesn't ruin the storyline. And unlike a trailer, it actually shows what the game is like, rather than showing what the creators of the game want you to think the game is like. So, uh, I've been preparing a little world. Uh, there's loads of... hang, hang on. Uh, before we get to that, if I go on here, uh, there's loads of little game modes. A military campaign, economic... Uh, that's just like a little... Uh, war thingy, what's it? I don't really know how to explain it. Free build, which is what I made the map that I'm going on to. That, that's what I made it on. And user maps. So, I don't quite know what user maps is, but anyway, if we go on load game here, and I load this, and this, oh, it didn't, it just doesn't look like it's taking too long. Okay, I was wrong. No, it is going to take a while. Um,. I'm out. Uh, I think I'll stop recording, then come back once it's finished loading, because it may take a while. Okay, guys, so the start of this will be a little bit laggy. The loading screen just finished. Uh, it actually, it might all be a bit laggy. Uh, the game isn't usually this laggy when you play it. Hang on. If I just hop on the settings, I could probably bring them down a bit. Not sound. Sound is fine. Graphics. Uh, just stick it on low, shall we? Whatever, I'll do. So obviously there are different settings of graphics now because I'm on a laptop. I will obviously have to keep mine quite low, but whatever. Uh, uh, I don't. What is that? I never actually found out what that was. It just looks like a campfire for no apparent reason in the middle of my map. Um, so yeah, I'll start off from the top. Uh, I have made this little castle sort of area right over here. Um, so in here we have the main sort of building, the barracks, armory, a little house, some little things making weapons, candle store, wheat. Uh, it's it's a complicated system thing. Uh, but yeah, I've got a church here, and the church requires candles, so that's why I've got candle makers over here. Um. Got a nice big wall surrounding this inner bit. Over here, I had to go a bit weird because it was going over a mountain. Uh, but, you know, that's alright. Uh, what else do I have? Okay, so in here we have this This is where everything is stored. Uh, everything that isn't food. Uh, wheat doesn't really count as food. Neither does flour or hops. I suppose ale does, but that's stored in there, so, you know. How do I get wool? Oh, whatever. Um, See, so yeah, this is the food stuck just here. Got a lot of food in here. Oh, look. I could just go to town on there, just eating. Oh. Ah, uh, yeah. So there's that. Um, now, you, you can see some bread in there. Well, the bread has to come to these things, get mushed up into flour, then has to go to some of these to become bread. Uh, the ale has to be brought in as this thing called hops then it goes in here and becomes nail it's pretty weird uh, but I need to buy some of these because there's not many of them left thank you buy some of those too um, I'm gonna move my soldiers out just for fun poops and giggles uh, I don't, nah, they're, they're fine there, you know, I don't need to do anything. So, into the second layer, this is mostly housing. I also have a church, a stage, I don't know, because down here this is what people think of you. Sentiment is warm towards me. Great. Uh, so we have, like, food stocks, they're not pretty happy with that because I've got them on quarter rations, and but at least we've got a wide variety of food. 
Down here, I'm giving them alcohol, so they're pretty they're happy about that. Uh, I'm giving them church services, so they're cool with that. Mood is pretty good. Uh, I have got taxes, so they're not thrilled about that. If I brought that down, then I wouldn't get any taxes, but they'd be pretty damn happy. Uh, here we have what's this? This is the market that allows me to buy and sell things. You saw me buy some of these things and some of that a moment since. Um, over here we've got more houses and a pub or an inn which is obviously where all the ale goes so that people can actually drink it. And out here I've got my agricultural farmy land uh, so we've got this a uh, hops that you need for um, ale. We've got a lot of cow things. You don't kill the cows for beef too bad. Uh, you just get cheese. Uh, apple trees for apples obviously. Pigs, that's where the meat comes from. And um, grain, which is how you get flour and then you get bread. So that's all the like, stuff that sustains the village. And then stuff that you need, you, know, you obviously need stuff to build all of these things. So that one obviously requires stone because it's made out of stone. That, uh, these obviously require wood because I've made of wood. Uh, so you see how that works. Um, so over here we have this is an iron um, what's it? iron mine. Uh, yeah, I was trying to remember that word then. And where's the little fella? Uh, oh, there he is. This little guy. Uh, this big old well, no, little ox. Big old little ox. He carries all the iron because obviously a human can't just carry a giant lump of iron, can they? Um, and same over here, we've got a load of oxes, and we've got two stone masons or whatever. I'm uh, just having a little bit of a rest. Oh wait, no, they're another note. It's because their thing's full. Ah, uh, so yeah, they they just like it's a quarry, but I I like to call it a stone mason. So whatever. Um, little castle wall. This little fella, I, I don't know what this is actually. They call it a pitch rig, and what he gets is called pitch, but I have no idea what the hell it is and what you do with it. I, j I just sort of put that there and said, eh, go to town, mate, you can get whatever you want. And then obviously over here we have wood. These guys have just knocked down a tree and turned it into planks. They're just wandering off to. Uh, same with these guys, just wandering to put it in the stockpile. That's the problem, and they have to come in and put it in the stockpile. It's right down here, so they have a long walk. But yeah, that's pretty much my castle. Um, I'm not sure how long I spent showing you that, but you know, whatever. Um, so that, that is part of the game. Oh yeah, and you obviously have like military stuff. So I've got like two siege thingies here, and some arches along the walls and then you saw my spearman down here and my lord fella who's like the leader of everything um but yeah there's not there's in in this free build there's nothing to attack you so there's not much point in any of that so yeah um now we're gonna head over uh so yeah obviously it's got the same save interface as all the other games you just do that um saved. Um, now I may need to start recording because sometimes it gets a little bit temperamental when you try and quit to the title screen. So I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, it didn't actually get upset with me. That's cool. Um, so we'll go into the game modes here. Now, I have done some of the military campaign but I have not had a look at the economic campaign. Now military campaign is pretty much these guys are trying to attack you you attack them so that they, you know, that kind of thing. Now I want to have a look it at. It almost doesn't matter who starts a war. Jesus, or what that's it's about. Loud. Most people, the farmers, the workers, the families, they don't care. They only care that their lives are torn apart, that nothing is the same as it used to be. During the war, villages, towns, settlements were all destroyed. We watched the Abbey fall, and along with it, our faith. Our hope. The hardest part of war comes after it's over. When the person in charge of the lands has to rebuild, has to try to give the people back a part of what they lost. After this war, I am that person. 
I suddenly find myself with a nation full of people who want nothing more than to get their lives back. Cool story, bro. With the Abbey, a symbol of hope and peace. And through that rebuilding, perhaps we might help all the people rebuild in their own way. We have few resources. Only the greatest builders could hope to achieve so much with so little. Okay, that sounds like fun, doesn't it? Wow. Uh, hi, I'm a girl. One of the first things to oh, go geez. during the war was our resources. We lost all our stone, our wood, our tools. Stolen by cruel pigs with little thought for the people. Ah, look Even at this think dumb about people. The abbey, <laughs> we need to set up a quarry. That guy on the left looks so pleased with himself. Look at what I did, boss. <laughs> Before we can even think about rebuilding the abbey, we need to set up a working quarry that will supply the stone for the building. Yes. This is the campaign. Basically, you you have objectives, and you have to achieve those. Um, it's pretty obvious. That's like most campaigns. Uh. I'm just gonna place my stop pile down here. Sight your granary, sire. Sight your granary, sire. Oh, okay. I'm going to place that there, my lord. <laughs> what the hell is that? Is that plague? Speed is of the essence, as the wooden stone needs to be shipped very soon ahead of the craftsman's arrival. Okay, I got a load of little apple farms up. What the hell is all this? Jesus. It's like someone's taking a giant. Uh, I'm gonna say that they farted for the younger audience. I'm gonna say that someone's farted. That'll, that'll make the younger audience giggle. Uh, but what I wanted to say was something much different. I'm gonna keep it clean. I'm not gonna swear. I'll place a little quarry here. Uh, is there anywhere else to place a little quarry? Obviously not. We'll place. I'd like to place two of them somewhat near each other. And uh, we'll just get a load of ox. This site is rich in stone deposits, but we may have to clear some of the undergrowth away first to get at them. Excuse me. We uh, need wood, sire. Oh, you need wood. Oh, okay. I wondered why they weren't like going for it. it was just a, um. You you not all right with this? Oh, okay. What's this? You know that whole story thing included a chick, and now there's a dude here. What the? Okay, so obviously in these campaigns, I'm not going to be like. How much time do I have? Oh, I have ages. Look, I've almost got. All, well, no, I've got nowhere near all this time, but you know, it's cool, bruh. Your food starts doing what? I'll bring it down to half. They are not best pleased. <laughs> That's what I like in this. The music. The music is like half the game. Because they've got like old timey music. Which is cool bro. Oh, la 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 la. La 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 Why is there green stuff over here? It's scaring me quite a lot. <laughs> I, I really don't get what this is. Is It's like someone is just taking a dump and then forgot to clean themselves. Like clean up. People are leaving the castle. <laughs> Well, they can leave the castle if they want. I'm gonna shoot them through the head. I really don't like this song. <laughs> Put that wood in there. In the hills here, and bears roam freely in these parts. Our peasants need protection if they are to work unmolested. Where are these bears? Where are these bears? Because honestly, I can't see a single one of them. I think they're lying to me. I don't think there are any bears. I think they're just... Ah, look at these bears, because there aren't any, and you're not going to find them, you stupid person. That's what they're doing in this game. I can sense it. 
There are there are no bears. Okay, so that ox is all happy over here. People are coming to the castle. Oh my goodness! Death, death, oh! I need my wood. We, we don't have many wood peoples. Um. That's a lot of apples. Jeez. Just making apples like nobody's business. Here, I have an apple. Oh, cool. Thanks for the diet. Are there people working over here yet? No, no, this the no. Oh, you need three people per like everything for it to actually start working. So these guys are stuck here. Like, where, where are you, Jim? We need your assistance. Oh, do we need to clear all this? Jeez, look at that. A large health. Damage. I'm just gonna build like a little shack over here. Oh man, let me build my shack. <laughs> just right over here in the far corner. Out of everybody's way. Jim, what are you doing over there? <laughs> I, I just wanted to be away from it all, you know. All the hubbub. Sentiment is warm towards you, mm, The sentiment is warm towards you, marriage. Mm. Although the people do think you're a bit of a twat. Oh. Okay, well. Again, my liege. Ah! Rain! Rain, rain, go away, come again someday. Apothecary. It's raining. It's had to ignorant. People are unsure of you, sire. Dude, it's not my fault it's raining. Get off my back. Are leaving the castle. I'm sorry it's raining. I can't really do much about it, mate. Jesus. Oh, it's raining. We hate you now. Oh, sorry. I'll just speak to the gods and ask them to change the weather, eh? How's that? Enraged bears are scaring our peasants, my liege. What the hell? Where are these bears? I can't see no bears, mate. Mate, I can't see a bear. Oh, this thing. I want to kill the bugger. Quickly. Just like meander over there, like, oh, bear, whatever. Don't you kill my peoples! F you then. Yeah, bear, suck it. I kill you and I kill everything you stand for. Ho. I really don't get what that was about. That was weird. Uh, but he, the bear did kill one of my peoples. Hey, look, it's not raining anymore. Cool. Uh. You can just stand guard there, you know. Everybody's been killed. Sentiment is warm towards you, my I don't really give about <sighs> whatever. What's this? Padlock. Oh, I need wood to make houses. 
Oh, damn it. I'm running out of time. I can't see myself using much um, stone. Ah, my leg. Jesus, what the hell? I thought so. Just sit there on the outskirts of the town. Ah, oh, it's fine. At least we got sows in. Okay, we've actually got people working now. That's good. Hang on, right. One, two, three, four. Uh, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We need a few more peoples. Then we'll have a full workforce. I think. Oh, hang on. Looks like we're getting a full lot together anyway. The people are racked with disease, my lord. It's most nah. disgusting. Alright, where, where, how much does that... We'll get some goddamn wood then. Quickly. Okay, so if they walk into that, they die. That's not good. Because that's the exact path that all of my wood people take. Um, right, you know what? I don't think this is going to go too well, so I might finish doing this campaign. But you guys have got a good idea of what this game is like. It is not easy. But it can be fun. It has its moments of being fun. And anyway, I think I've shown you quite a lot of this. And I think I've got quite a bit of footage. I don't want to make this too long. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. Like I said, this was the last episode. Uh, going up on my channel for quite a while. I can't see myself doing this. I probably will replace it with something. But, you know, I don't know. Uh, so please like it. If you did like it. Or if you like the game. Uh, comment. Tell me what you think of the game. Um, or just leave a general comment. Um, subscribe, please, if you already haven't. And head over to the Respawn Army app and find this and like it. Uh, bump it, even. That's what you do on there, please, because that helps me out a lot. Uh, if you can't find it, then just search IVX Rising Sun, all one word with all the capitals and stuff, the same as my YouTube name. Um, search that in the Fine Gamers. Uh, and if you are already on the Respawn Army and you're watching this, then please bump it. Uh, it will help me. And a link to my channel is in the description. I'm not sure if it will work, but it's at least there so you can you know, copy and paste it or whatever. So, thank you guys. And goodbye.